Veterans Day is all about the people who served, including those who are no longer with us. Today in Cullen County, an artist helped make sure that their legacy will be remembered. Here's Sebastian Robertson. Time does not heal all wounds. For 71-year-old Mike Hale, it only dulls the heartbreak. The hurt never goes away. You're, you're always uh, in thought. It, uh, it was very tough on, on the family. It was uh, especially tough on my mom. 50 years ago, his brother Lanny was killed while saving a troop of Marines pinned down in Vietnam. Today in McKinney. And thank you to the family members that are here. A brother's sacrifice is memorialized. Five new paintings have been added to the walls of the Collin County Courthouse, a tradition now in its fifth year. Colin Kimball, a veteran himself, is the artist. If you remember their name, then I've accomplished my job, and they've never been forgotten. Each soldier's story is researched, and each reproduction takes months. Even their placement on the wall is taken into account. These two had to be together, and I'm, I'm, I'm glad we accomplished that task. Next to Lonnie, you'll see a fellow Wiley High School graduate. Jerry Combest was killed during an ambush in the jungles of South Vietnam. This shortly after his best friend was killed. Half a century later, they're together again. Great photo, great picture. A chance for Hale to see his brother, how he'll always remember him. I know that my brother is with Jesus, and I wait impatiently today that I'll be able to uh, join him in heaven. And a wall of portraits that are worth a second look. In McKinney, Sebastian Robertson, Channel 8 News.